Hello. I'm Shayna. This I'm is Bridges. All right. Awesome. We're here with Ask the Eagles. Uh, we post a message on Twitter trying to get questions uh, for us to answer. Um, so people from the internet asked us a lot of interesting questions and we're about to go through those right now. Question from uh, Box. Um, what is the most impressive play by a team you've played against? First thing that comes to my mind actually is us. Uh, Nations Cup 2011. Okay. Fly half. England fly half. Moth guards flying. Oh, oh, <laughs> most impressive play by us. Yeah. Okay. I think that was pretty fun. Yeah. You know, knocking people's mouth guards out is always, you know, something to strive for. <laughs> um, I think the most impressive play by another team, uh, I, I actually don't even remember the player, um, but I think. Uh, whenever people kick and then like run through the line and catch, catch it, it and then keep running, uh, it always makes me really mad and also impresses me a lot. So. Uh, Pam Kinsanke wants to know which USA Women's Eagle is going to give the biggest hit of the game. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, uh, I think that's a tough question. I think a lot of us out on the yeah. field are capable of putting in some big hits. Uh, we have a pretty physical team. Uh, I would probably say the Coug as well. We're yeah. referring to Linnell Coogler, oh, no. <laughs> uh, our number seven, and uh, the person you most want on your team uh, at any U.S. assembly, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, watch out for her. Number seven on her back, and mouth guards flying, probably. Steen yeah. asked, uh, how long have you been playing, and how did you get into rugby? Since 2006, uh, I started um, at Texas A&M. Um, Kind of got into it just by chance at a freshman orientation. Um, got asked to come try out practice. You were, wait, what were you looking for? I was uh, <laughs> looking for the powerlifting table. I did powerlifting in, <laughs> in high school. Um, and so, yeah, I couldn't find it. And a couple of the rugby girls came up to me and convinced me to come out to practice. And from there on, the rest is your history. Right, huh? yeah. yeah. I was actually in a bar in Ireland, a pub as you would call it. And uh, some tall, athletic-looking girls came up to me and asked me if I fancied a crack at rugby. And uh, I wasn't doing anything else. So <laughs> went out, practiced, and played two days later in my first game. So it was kind of a whirlwind. But it was 06 as well. 